hey guys what's up welcome back to online classes and have a pleasant morning to all of you now i ajay kumar your english teacher is going to do the question answer of the chapter the tale of the custard the dragon as we have uh, previously learnt all the stanzas line by line explanation we have seen the summary also and we have uh, learnt about the literary devices used in that now today we will see question answer we will try to attempt question answer and i'll expect everyone to answer in the comment section box as well now what type of message we have learnt from this uh, chapter that is also necessary so we will see uh, what type of message we have learnt the message from this chapter is very clear and that is do not judge a book by its cover you can be brave even when you are afraid real courage comes from love so this is the message which we have learned from this chapter now we will move ahead and we'll see the question answer in that we'll see we'll start from uh, multiple choice question then we'll see very short question answer short question answer and long question answer so let's begin the name of the yellow drag yellow little dog was what was the name of yellow little dog answer it fast i know you can answer it fast that was mustard that is correct next question we'll see what was the name given by belinda to the dragon what was that name given that is custard option d we'll see next what was the name of the little black kitten answer it fast in the comment section box next a blink was a fill in the blank and ink was fill in the blank now what which option will be the correct answer option b now we'll see uh, what was the color of the wagon is it red white green yellow that was red now we'll see a uh, very short question answer belinda lived in a can you answer answer it in the comment section box she lived in a white house who all lived with belinda there were four characters you no know, living with belinda if you can name them name in the comment section box i'll tell you the one or two name that is ink and blink Re remaining two name you can answer in the comment section box and i'll show you the answer as well that is a kitten a mouse dog and a dragon next question what did custard long for custard of kis cheez ke bare mein hamesha bolta rehta tha the answer is a nice safe cage next question we'll see who killed the parrot custard killed the parrot now we'll see who attacked belinda house belinda's house that was a pirate now we'll see short question answer now the first question uh, in short question answer is describe the physical appearance of the pirate so you can i think uh, you can uh, describe about the physical appearance how was pirate looking like the pirate looked quite dreadful and dominating he carried as uh, he carried a pistol uh, in his left as well as in right hand he held a shining dagger in his mouth his beard was black and one of his legs was of wood it seemed that uh, his intentions were terrible we'll see next question how did the other three pet boast of their bravery boast means phekna you know to kaise wo logon ne apne bravery ke bare mein bahadri ke bare mein kahaniyan sunayi 
Now the answer to this question is after mustard, ink and blink, a uh, fled on seeing the pirate. It was Custard who fought him and killed him. The other pets soon made excuses for their cowardice and said that they would have been twice and thrice as brave as Custard. Now we'll see next question. How can you say the uh, names of animals reflect their personalities? Now think and answer of this question. If you can, however, I'll show you the answer. The name of Belinda's pets are black kitten, that is ink, yellow dog, that is mustard, gray mouse, that is blink, and a dragon, that is custard. So here their names reflect the colors and traits. The black uh, kitten ink is black as ink, mustard, the dog is yellow like mustard flowers. The cowardly custard has no straight strength of character like the dish custard. Next question. Conclude the lesson uh, we learned from the poem. I will have to conclude. As I have given you the you know, message in the starting so you can <coughs> add that also. The poet gives a definite message. Merely outer appearance and physical strength don't make a person brave. One should have the strength of mind and self-confidence to be really great. The dragon, custard, had lot of physical strength and he swallowed the pirate. Usko chaba gaya, kacha chaba gaya. Piece by piece usko kaat diya usne. In spite of that, he was bullied and mocked at for his timidity and cowardly behavior because his behavior was like he was behaving like a dog so he was having the more physical strength than ink, blink and mustard next question we'll see discuss the bravery of everyone in the house we have to talk about all the bravery so Belinda was a brave Belinda was as brave as a barrel full of beers Ink and Blink were brave enough to chase lions away. Uh, now, Mustard bravery was like tiger's rage. It was only Custard who was a coward. Everyone else was very brave. Now we'll see long question answer. So the first question in long question answer segment, the dragon Custard was considered as a, considered a coward. The humble dragon proved his bravery in adversity. जब बहुत ज़्यादा ज़रूरत था जहाँ पे bravery दिखाने का उस जगह पे उसने अपनी bravery दिखाई थी. So analyze the certain qualities like bravery and courage are situational and spontaneous. वो स्थिति के अनुसार से और खुद ब खुद निकल के आता है. इसके बारे में इस qualities के बारे में analyze करना है. Express your views with reference to the poem. Now you can read and even you can take the screenshot though I will, I will read the answer for you. Bravery and courage are situational and spontaneous. Custard the dragon does not boast of his bravery as other pets of Belinda do. The other animals boasted of their bravery and made fun of dragon's cowardice but when the real danger came only one of them could face the danger. It was only the dragon who dared to face the threatening pirate who appeared really threatening with pistols and knife. Custard, the dragon, rose to the situation and showed his real bravery and gobbled up the pirate in dangerous situation. Usko nigal gaya tha wo. Uske baad usko chawa bhi gaya tha. Thus, the qualities like bravery and courage can be tested when someone is actually put in a dangerous situation. So, I mean, when you put in a dangerous situation, you put in a dangerous situation, then you put in a dangerous situation. We'll see next question. Describe the fight between the dragon and the pirate in brief. Uh, the dragon had big sharp teeth and spike 
on top of him and the scales underneath but everyone laughed at him as he always cried for a safe cage whereas everyone boasted about their bravery but when the pirate entered all were scared and ran away and disappeared except clustered who faced him boldly attacked him hit him hard with his forceful tail and gobbled every bit of him all of them later felt obliged to custard for saving their life next question evaluate ogden nash the tale of custard the dragons as a ballad what message does the poet give to the readers in this poem to isko hum log evaluate karenge ballad hai i've told you now you can take the screenshot since it is a long answer ballad are stories told in words generally ballads are tales of adventurous and heroism ek sahasik aur jo heroic you know jisme nayak banke koi nikalta hai us tarike ka kahani hota hai ballad in the form of poem in the poem the poet does present the encounter of custard and the pirate in the typical uh, spirit of a ballad the four line stanzas have the rhyme scheme a a b b throughout the poem ogden nash gives a subtle message to the readers through the fate of custard the dragon in this world of a deceit self confidence self dependence and self respect are essentials to earn your rightful place among your peers the mere presence of physical strength is not enough the more important point is that you must be conscious of your strength you must be fully aware of the fact that many others who are far inferior in strength and power should have no right to taunt and already now we have finished this chapter and uh, we will now meet in another video with new chapter with more explanation so stay tuned with the channel do like and subscribe the channel and uh, stay fit stay safe at your home we'll meet in another video till then bye take care and have a nice day thank you everyone